In 1879, Thomas Edison invented a workable electric light bulb at his laboratory in Menlo Park, New Jersey. During his test, the bulb lasted 13 and a half hours. This would be the invention of the first commercially practical incandescent light. Popular belief is that he invented the first light bulb, which he did not. The first electric light was actually created in 1802 by English scientist Humphrey Davy. In 1954 this week, Texas Instruments announced the first transistor radio. They quickly became the most popular electronic communication device in history, with billions manufactured during the 60s and 70s. In 1984 this week, the Airphone service was launched on 20 flights for those who had credit cards. Of course, you paid for that convenience of talking on the phone while in the air. Cost for the service was $7.50 for a three-minute call, $1.25 for each additional minute anywhere you wanted to call in the U.S. In 1985, Intel introduced the 32-bit 8386 microcomputer chip. It was the first Intel 86 chip to handle 32-bit data sets. It ran at speeds of up to 33 megahertz, which was blazingly fast in 1985. And this week in 1998, Microsoft and prosecutors for the U.S. Department of Justice and 20 states met in federal court. It was the beginning of that massive antitrust case against the Microsoft Corporation. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History, brought to you by IFA in Berlin. IFA, the Global Innovations Show. 6,000 media representatives, 2,600 from abroad. It's IFA time. Meet the official partner of the future in Berlin. Be sure to check out our website anytime at intotomorrow.com and subscribe to our free podcast while you're there. We'll catch you next time on This Week in Tech History.